which turns to Key West, now under a tropical storm watch, and that's where we find local host Christian De La Rosa live with the preparations in place. Christian. You may not be able to tell anything is coming because Duval Street looks and sounds exactly like Duval Street would on any other Friday night, but things could change drastically come tomorrow. The rush to take the picture at the iconic landmark before it comes. Probably some lightning, probably trees everywhere. If we get high enough winds, the store's probably going to flood a little bit. Lynn Orloff at Florida Bay Outfitters in Key Largo says all her merchandise will be going to higher ground ahead of the heavy rainmaker, which could turn severe. It seems like a lot of people are pulling their boats out today, but it seemed like a lot of people were on the water today too, just like soaking up the last bit of good weather before we get the storm. Out on the water, they could already tell. The water was really crazy. Yeah, it was kind of rough. Up north, from Tampa to Tally, many say they're ready for whatever the storm may bring. I'm going to the grocery store. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has already declared a state of emergency ahead of the weather event forecasted for this weekend. Florida Emergency Management Director Kevin Guthrie. Right now, people should probably be focusing on more so where do I need to stay if I need to evacuate? State officials also stressing people prepare in case of a possible insurance claim. Florida's chief financial officer, Jimmy Petronas, says take pictures. Now you've got photographic evidence before the storm hits of what your house looked like on the inside and the outside. Back in the Keys. As far as I know, we don't ever close. Bring your ponchos. Yes. Got to pick up all the junk in my yard. And your thoughts about the storm that's coming? Party time. I pray for the people up north that are going to get it. Honestly, I've been in Florida my entire life, so I'm just I'm winging it. Winging it. It's a way of life for many. Of course, we'll be here throughout the night monitoring the situation as well as tomorrow, and we will cross our fingers and hope for the best. Live in Key West, I'm Christian De La Rosa, Local 10.